Guys, this is world's first. Out of a Cuban coffee cup, if you watch this video, you will see how to catch micro fish, world's smallest mini fish right here. This is pretty cool. Guys, comment below if this is the perfect size home for him. Look, I hope he doesn't ah! so Guys, welcome back to another episode of Monster Mike Fishing. For those of you that are new to the channel, we do crazy fishing DIYs and fishing challenges. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn your notifications on. Hey guys, this is Monster Mike and you're watching Monster Mike Fishing. Making the world's smallest fish pond. Shut up. We give a shout out to one lucky subscriber that gets all the trivia questions correctly in every video. Today's shout out winner is Mike Hopper. Congrats, you got all the trivia questions right in the last video. But stay tuned because there's gonna be another trivia question coming up at the end of this episode. For a chance to win a shout out. Hey. No. Quiet. Hey. Hey, we're trying to work. No, hey, they're sizing us up, dog. Ooh, ooh. Come on, hey. Oh, hey. oh, let's get them. Let's get them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You run your mouth, right? You run your mouth, right? I'll talk, oh. baby. I'll talk. I'll talk. Hey. Hey, hey, all, hey, all talk just flies. Yeah. That's it. This is Miami. This is my hood. We run them hands. They just spread their wings. Speaking of Miami, what do we drink down here? Ooh, we drink that, that coffee. That, what kind? We drink that culotta. Culotta, baby. Culotta. Guys, if you're in Miami, this is a must. You cannot start your day without having the colada, baby. Well, they ran over there and they're still talking trash. Dang. Every time when we get Cuban coffee, they always give the, oh. Every time when we get Cuban coffee, they always give us extra cups. So today we're gonna use one of these cups. Hold get on. it together, Mike. Get it together, Mike. Today we're gonna be using one of these tiny little Cuban coffee cups to turn this in to an awesome fish pond. But before we get started on this DIY, you already know I need a shot of that coffee. Guys, comment below if you ever had some of this. I mean, this, this that, this that fuel, this that Miami fuel. I always extend the pinky. Not a lot of people know how to drink Cuban coffee down here in Miami. This is the thing, if you're not extending the pinky, then when you're drinking it, it's not gonna hit you right. You have to extend the pinky. Well, this shows how sophisticated you are. Yes, it shows how you're living. Just like that. All right, oh! Hey, oh! 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 Oh, oh, oh. Today we got Cuban coffee cups and we're gonna make it into an awesome fish pond. You don't want to miss it. Stay tuned. We have a net. We're gonna we're gonna net minnows and we're gonna have. A... Here you go, Brian. Thank you, sir. Take a shot with me. Oh. Pinky out. Yep, pinky out. Pinky out. Guys, comment below. Pinky. And I will heart your comment because not a lot of people know why to extend. Show your status in life, you know. Show it. Pour that up, pour that up. Oh, right there? Let's see. Oh, bro, oil. Gas. Pinky out. Pinky out. Woo! Nice. Ooh. Bougie as hell, look at the diamond. Bougie! Back to the DIY. We're gonna turn this tiny little Cuban coffee cup into the best fish pond. We're gonna turn this into a fish pond. We're gonna add aquarium rocks, plant fish. Let's go, we got our net. Look over here. Look over here. Crystal clear water. Oh, I see the minnows! So guys, you don't see the minnows, but there's a lot of action in the water. The minnows like to, to hide underneath the weeds and stuff. This is when we get the net, we go by the weeds and we And then usually I have a bunch of minnows in here and the minnows are small enough to go inside this Cuban coffee cup. And this is gonna be the world, this is gonna be so awesome. I can't wait. Without hurting myself, I'm gonna go down there. Should we put the decorative rocks first? You should be a teacher. You're smart, Brian. We're, I am gonna, Asian. we're gonna first add the aquarium rocks. Should we get him out of the truck too? You know what? Yeah, we'll be back, guys. <laughs> we'll be back. 
All right, the first thing we gotta do is add aquarium rocks in the coffee cup. We gotta find some aquarium rocks. I know that there's some leftover aquarium rocks in here. From that last video. From their last video. 200,000 views already. Um, I need some color. Uh, this this oh. aisle. Oh, perfect. Done. You know what? Oh, can, we, can we shop in this aisle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last but not least, oh my gosh. This Cuban coffee cup is starting to look like an awesome fish pond already. All right, guys, we got the aquarium rocks. And what's a fish pond without, you know, natural plants? We need the, so we need just amount of, oh, oh, wait, wait. Maybe this is too much. We're gonna, oh, perfect. I think that's, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, guys, we added the plant, we added the aquarium rocks. Guys, this is world's first. You guys never seen a Cuban coffee cup like this before. We're... A little windy. Yeah. All right, guys, our DIY Cuban coffee cup fish pond is pretty much complete. All we gotta do is add some water. We're gonna add an air bubbler, and we're gonna add a tiny fish. I'm gonna use this coffee cup to scoop up some water from the canal and enter it in to our new fish pond. Oh my God. Bro, those are minnows. Those are in. I think those are mollies, baby mollies. But there's a lot of a uh, lot of minnows down there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Brian, that's over here. Brian, I just oh, it's a peacock. Oh, baby peacock almost tried to get one of the minnows. Scoop of the water. I think one scoop is uh, fine. Oh, that looks good. Woo. And there you have it, guys. We have a fish pond out of a Cuban coffee cup. They need to answer the phone. I guess we'll wait till the phone stops ringing. Hello? McFly? Okay. Hold on one second. Maybe this is the last one. No. Maybe this one. If it rings one more time, we're just gonna get right to the video. Oh, I see him. I see him, Mike. Oh, guys. We need the world's smallest fish to fit inside of that little, tiny little coffee cup. So uh, I got my net, and we're gonna see if we're gonna scoop one up. Net game. There's different type of things in these weeds, uh, creatures. There's crawdads. There's little. Uh, there's little minnows. There's little sea, uh, little shells like little snails and stuff. So oh, oh, bro. There's a. There's a bunch of like tiny fish all on top of the water. All right guys, so there's a bunch of little micro fish. We got our net. Let's see what we can catch for the world's smallest fish pond. Oh bro, they're all right here. Oh, I see them. Let me see if I can zoom in on them. The method to catching these, you have to go quick. You can't go slow, you have to draw. Look right in that patch of grass, a little bit further forward. See him? Just too far. Let me just, just drag it, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna drag it. Because if we get a crawl dad or something, that would, that would be, be pretty cool. cool. I mean, it is a pond. Okay, nothing there. Nope. Guys, this is an awesome way to also catch like little minnows, you know, for bait when you're fishing, all you need is a net and, and the method is just drag, like you wanna just have have it touching the bottom and scraping. A lot of people don't explain how to catch little crawfish and minnows with the net because they don't wanna spill out their recipe, but I'm gonna give you the recipe. I got that recipe to change your destiny. Look, what did I tell you? We got the decors that we're gonna add. We got the decor, that n live natural decors that we're gonna add into the fish pond. Wow, let's see what else we got. <gasps> see, guys, that's why if you watch this video, you will, you will see how, if you watch this video, you will see how to catch micro fish, seashells, um, crawfish, and more. I bet you there's a crawfish. We might have a grand slam. If you get a, a seashell, a fish, and a crawfish in one scoop, that's called a hood grand slam. No. But uh, yeah, this was a really good intelligent scoop. Little, like, not, little knowledge about these three species. I know what your guys are thinking right now. Mike, the fish is dying. Oh, swam away. 
Hey Mike, try and go a little bit deeper. Come on, bro. It's starting to sound like my girl. I can't go that deep, but I'm gonna try. I'm hitting some wall rocks. What you got? What you bro, got? Bro, bro, I went deeper. See, guys, anyone can do this. All you need is a net and they sell these in the pet store. Not sure for how much, but comment below if you know the proper name of this. I think it's a glass minnow, but I could be wrong. Is this like a sand flea or a sand perch? It's Something. Got a it's gotta be a snook. It, oh my gosh, guys, I got a baby snook. I, Br Brian, I, I say this every time. You should be a teacher. You're smart. Guys, we have a baby snook. We got the lateral line across. That's how you know it's a snook. They change shape as they get older. They change shape as they get older. Yes, the mouth starts in lark. You know the vibe. It's not a snook. <laughs> There's also like little blue rare um, crawfish and stuff. I'm not sure if they're here. I caught them before, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do the long stroke method. I'm gonna start off from that end, and I'm gonna long stroke it this way to see if I catch anything. And just to be clear, you've never been able to long stroke before, right? So this is your first attempt? This is my first time long stroking because everything I do is just short. I'm going all the way. Bro, I hope, I hope we get something cool. I hope we get something cool. Brian, Michael, Brian. <laughs> Corona. Comment below, the king, and I will heart your comment because I got the biggest fish ever. <gasps> There's my crawfish, my guy. Okay, you got it. Yeah, yeah. Look. Why did you look up there? No, because I, I want. <laughs> I'm like, what's over there? No, because I want to just spread it out. But I guess we'll do oh, it here. We can spread it out. <gasps> Let's go. This Let's... is a lit, bro. Because I saw two or three things. Hey. Hey, don't hey, don't click off so they know that this is all legit. Yeah, yeah. This is what happens when you long stroke. Huh? My brother, look what I got. And here you have it. That's why you don't want to click off this video. With this netting method, you get you get mini lobsters like this. Min, mini miniature lobsters for the world's smallest fish pond. This is a nice little mini. I hope he doesn't. Ah! Uh, Oh my gosh, Brian! You long stroke and got crabs? I long stroke and I got some crabs. <laughs> Brian, 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 we have a bluegill. We have a sunfish. This is what happens, bro. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Stop moving! You can still say, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! Guys, we have a baby lobster. We have a baby lobster and a nice little. And Mang I. A little mango snapper. No. <laughs> guys, I. I, I, it's a it's a crop ear of bluegill. Comment below. Comment below if you know. Oh my gosh. Let's see if he crawls. He crawls. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. All right, guys. So we got a small fish from that scoop. We got a baby. I think it's a crawfish or a lobster. Comment below if this is a crawfish or a lobster. I think it's a lobster because it kind of looks like those lobsters that they sell at Red Lobster. And then there is also a... Oh, oh bro. Bro. Mini. World's smallest mini fish right here. This is pretty cool. Let's go release these cool creatures. Should I just, I believe I can fly it or? Uh, or, or be nice. Yeah, let's be nice. Okay. All right guys, this was a good scoop, but he's a little bit too big for the world's smallest fish pond. That one's a little too dead, right? This one's a little too dead. All let's right. see if they're still alive though. Oh, he's swimming. Oh, yeah. there he goes. He swam. Oh, uh, they, they use the, they, they just play dead like dogs. Like a possum. Like a possum. All right, crawfish. Oh, no. All right, lobster. Oh, oh, we should name him Mr. Krabs. You get it? Like the crabs from SpongeBob? Like the crabs you got? All right. All right, buddy. Bye. Pew. And he's off. Oh, we got a fish. Oh, we got, a, oh, we got, a, we got the oh. best, we got the best pet fish. Is that a baby jewel? That is a baby jewel, guys. We can't lose him. Check him out, Brian. That is a baby African jewel cichlid. 
and I already know he's gonna fit good in the in the world's smallest fish pond. Let's let, let's see. We were just scraping the weeds to see what we can catch, and we got them. Awesome little tiny micro fish. Guys, give our new pet fish a name. Oh my gosh. Oh, and he's swimming. And he's swimming. Guys, comment below if this is the perfect size home for him. Look, he just did a 360, Brian. That means he can he can exercise. He can exercise. So guys, this is gonna look sick in your in your like kitchen table or, or, or on the counter while you're making coffee. That fish in there just did a whole 360. So that just means there's plenty of more room for him to have a friend. So we're gonna catch a different type of species of fish to add to the world's smallest fish pond. It's gonna be very, very sneaky. Very, very sneaky. Very, very sneaky. They're running. Quick jerk. Got him. Oh, Got him. It worked. Got him. <laughs> we got two friends. That method. We're, oh, bro. We we're going to name. Friends. Yes. Look. Oh, no, no, oh, no, no, no. We got one <laughs> friend. Hey, we're going to. Hey. Oh, look at that. We're going to name. I think it's a baby Wait, Molly. Oh my gosh, guys, I think this is a baby Molly or something. I'm just not sure, but look at the spot. We're gonna name him Spotty. Guys, comment below Spotty and I will heart your comment. Where did we you got go? no, no friends. No, I got him. Right. I got him. All right, guys. Look at that SA buff. Oh yeah, we got the SA buff. You already know, we're staying cool out here. He looks preg, she looks, look, he looks pregnant. Don't assume gender. Oh, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> guys, we already have one fish in the world's smallest fish pond out of a Cuban coffee cup, and now he has a friend. Oh my, now he has a friend that we're gonna add. Oh my gosh! He already wanted to go. Oh in. my gosh! That's how bad he wanted to go inside. Oh my gosh! If he can move like that, then he's good. Then he's good. You know what? If anything, I'll just add a little bit more water, guys. But I think, let me see, is he good or is he sleeping? Guys, comment below if they're good. I think, I think this is the best home for them because the big fish won't be able to eat them. But comment below, this is actually the best world's smallest, world's smallest fish pond. Guys, there you have it. With the net, we caught some awesome pet fish. Guys, no one in the world ever made a fish pond out of a Cuban coffee cup. Like, this is world's first, guys. Why don't you smash that like button if you enjoyed this video. Guys, there'll be plenty more videos to come. Comment below what you want us to see us do next, and we might just do it. Before we get right to the trivia questions, guys, if you haven't checked out the last video, it was magnet fishing. So if you guys like magnet fishing, the link will be at the end of this video. It's pretty cool. We caught some crazy stuff. But you guys know what time it is. It's time for trivia. Trivia, it's trivia, it's time for trivia. Trivia, it's trivia, it's time for trivia. Trivia, it's trivia, it's time for trivia. It's time for trivia. It is trivia time, so make sure you comment your answers correctly so you can be shouted out in the next episode. Trivia question number one. What did I use, what did I use to catch the fish? Trivia question number two, besides fish, name one other creature that we caught. And trivia question number three, besides a fish pond, what do we use these cups for? Guys, comment your answers below, and we're gonna pick one lucky winner to be shouted out in the next video. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Because we already have all the other stuff, right? Yeah. We So cut it, don't yeah. we're, So we're good we're then, done. right? We're we done. We already did the... Yeah. Subscribe to? Yeah. And Noda? No. Go ahead and say subscribe and notifications and all that good stuff. Guys, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Hit that notification bell and be sure to... Yeah, this that's not, not coffee. coffee. No. Can we go get some more?